Hi, it's Rachel. I am not a sex therapist. I'm just a regular therapist, but I do have a sex tip for women. And I've been wanting to talk about this for a long time. And I finally got up the courage to go for it. The caveat is that this is for women with new partners. If you have a partner already that you've been with, your boyfriend, fiance, husband, I recommend you talk to your therapist and you process and you make decisions before you decide to rock the boat or you know do anything new. Just talk to your therapist, okay? So my number one sex tip for women. The reason why this is important is that women think that it's okay to have power in the boardroom, corporate, business, but why not the bedroom? You know, that's lopsided. How is that equal? How is that fair? So we got to get with the times and we want to be equal partners everywhere, personal and professional. And so this is my tip for women. Stop faking orgasm. And there's a difference of opinion because men will tell me to my face, women don't fake with me. I know the difference. And if I had a dollar for every man who would tell that to me, I would have fuck you money. And then on the flip side, the women, if you have a woman talk to me, if she likes me, if she trusts me, she would tell me, yeah, yeah, I faked it in my life. So, you know, there's a disconnect. The men say, no, this doesn't happen to me. I know. The women say, yeah, I have faked it. So I'm just going to go with the women. I'm going to run with that because I am a woman and I always have their back. So if women fake orgasm, if this is common, and many women have done this, you know, in their life, why do you do it? A lot of reasons. It's very complex. It's very individualized. But why can you not change? Try something new with a new partner. Decide that you are not going to fake anymore. It's either real or, you know, that's how it is. And you're so afraid that, oh, the guy will reject you or, you know, you've never done it that way before, you're honest, but how do you expect the men to get any better in bed if all the women are lying to them and saying that they're great? How do you expect them to get better? And then also for yourself, you have this core piece that is missing, your own pleasure when you fake. How is that fair? How is that equal? You want power in the boardroom. Why cannot you have power in the bedroom? That's my number one sex tip for women. Start there.